All right, here we go. We are ready for the big hoot 2017 Hoot and Annie down in North Carolina. Big guys ready here. Got the big smile going. Ready to go, Rubio? I'm talking softly because it's like 4 30, 5 o'clock in the morning. Sun's just a popping up. Um, I hope to God this is going to be secure. I got 101 bungee cords. You know, I got super glue, duct tape, everything else you need. You know, to pack luggage. But, um,. Yeah, Godspeed everybody out there, man. Be safe. Heads on swivels here, and uh, this is going to be great. It's going to be awesome. I'm going to um, roll my bike down the road a little bit because I don't want to wake up my, wake up the family here in, in, uh, in uh, half the neighborhood. So I'm going to cut off here and uh, keep it down. I'll see you back on the road. All right, man. Hoot Nanny 2017. Finally freaking happening, Rubio. Oh, yeah. What up? Look at that. Okay. Let's pray you start up, buddy. All right, everybody. Peace. We'll see you out there. See you on the road. All right, stopped at one of my favorite places over here. I'm gonna say a little prayer for Rubio and I, and hope to God that this luggage stays on, because, man, I don't know. I mean, it's on there tight. I just, I don't know, man. It's the first time I've ever, ever backed Rubio like this, buddy. Feels like I get about, feels like I have about two bodies strapped on the back of the bike. A little sketchy, a little rocky, <laughs> a little shaky room. All right, man. And it's a little chilly. It's like 56 degrees, low humidity, and beautiful morning. I'm gonna hit I-84 westbound. Head out of Massachusetts here, get into Connecticut. Gonna meet Freedom Rider and Orvis 128 down to some Harley shop down there, which. It's about 50 minutes away from here, which means, well, 50 minutes riding a Harley is a good chance I might need a Harley shop. So it's a, it's a good thing we're actually meeting there, man. So hopefully they got some coffee ready. It's early. It's 5.30. I'm um, supposed to meet them at 5.45-ish. I'm late. I woke up uh, just a few minutes ago. Got about, I don't know, four minutes of sleep. That's all right, man. We're ready to go. We are ready. Hoot nanny, sir. We are ready. Ooh, Nanny 2017 is finally here. We've been playing this for a long time, as a lot of you guys know. I think Tex Rider's been on the road since yesterday. He's coming down from Canada. We got guys coming from Michigan, Tennessee, Georgia, Virginia area, Delaware. Um, I don't know, a bunch of other places too, I think. Louisiana, maybe. Um, Indiana, a couple guys come from Indiana. All over the place, man. This is nuts. Awesome, awesome time. But I'm gonna get going. Those guys are gonna end up waiting for me again, like usual. Rubio, you ready? Godspeed, buddy. You got my back, I got your back. And hopefully someone can pick up the backpacks on the road when they fall. Oh, boy. All right, man. Here we go. Whew. All right, first stop. Backpack check. <laughs> All right, it's still on. That's a good sign. Ten seconds later, uh, my glasses are my glass. I can't see. I see headlights right there. That's all I see. Glasses are all fogged, all covered. Yeah, I gotta take them off. Wow. <laughs> oh shit! You just see me right now. I got my glasses. I'm freaking cockeyed. I'm going sideways. I can't see. I got freaking headlights coming at me. It's July and I'm freaking cold. What the hell? This is gonna be great. I'm sure I forgot half the shit. Got the most important stuff. Got my debit card, my toothbrush, and my GoPro. After that, as long as you got your bike, I mean shit, what do you need? Oh yeah, I got a bag of jelly beans too. Actually, I packed the whole freaking cooler. I got a bunch of junk food and jelly beans and more junk food and some peanut butter and jellies. My biggest concern is coffee though. I don't know what the coffee situation is going to be in the hills of North Carolina, but man, I need my coffee. I need it often. I was going to pack, uh, just going to pack some camping gear, like Bunsen burners, <laughs> propane tank, and outdoor coffee pot. You guys excuse me a little bit. I have my, my headphones are on in my right ear. I got my earbud, my, uh, the wireless Bluetooth thing and and the radio's on and right now there's a there's a commercial about praying or something. It's, just, it's really loud so it's kind of screwing me up. 
All right, back check. All right. I can feel the uh, the bag and the cooler right behind me, but it's the bag and shit behind that. I have no clue, man. I'm just, I'm praying that it just stays on and hopefully my first stop, it's still there. I tell you what, the luggage knows how to take a turn, though. Good job, luggage. I'm impressed. Staying still, keeping the body square, not leaning in. This would be a good test right here, luggage. Kaplonk, I fucking everything falls. I'm telling you, I know it's gonna happen when we're going down the freaking highway. Something's gonna fly off, and I'm freaking cold. It's July 5th. Oh yeah, happy belated 4th, everybody. Go America. July 5th, and I'm freaking cold. I can't wait to get out of Massachusetts for freaking sakes. Oh my god, I'm freezing. Whew. I think the birds are even staying in right now. The geese are out of the water. It's so cold. Seriously, what happened to global warming, man? Damn it. They promised me. Damn you, Al Gore. He said it's supposed to be hot. I like my dash, too. Everything's reflecting the arch. <laughs> I don't know if the camera pick it up, be cool if it does, but everything, all the, um, everything's all freaking, I can't think right now, everything's orange. Alright, so let's go through this, this uh, here's a scoop. Meeting Freedom Ride at Orbis 128 down in Connecticut, about an hour from me, down south, southwestern Connecticut. And from there, we're going to be heading to Pennsylvania, like I said before, we're going to be meeting Jack Novell there. Uh, good, good chance we might, uh, me happy Jack down there in Pennsylvania. I know he's leaving PBD today at some point. PBD Mass, not Peabody, it's PBD. He'll be leaving there shortly, or if he already, maybe he already has. But he might meet us down there. We uh, Our times might cross somehow, some way. Or actually, I think he's leaving later. Yeah, I think he's working today. He's leaving a little bit later. I, I don't know, but we may meet up, meet up with Happy Jack. I hope we do. He's on. I can't wait to see him, meet him. He's awesome. The vlogger, man. I love him. Such a natural motor vlogger. Got such a good, deep, sexy motor vlog voice, you know. Key music. Yeah, that music. Motorcycles well, everywhere. I love this guy. These guys are good supporters of bikers over here. They're always, always sporting that sign out there. Yeah, I'll hold my clutch in. These well, people probably got the day off. Here it comes me and Rubio rumbling. Bum, 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 bum. You know, I do stuff like that. I don't know why. I, I guess I'm a nice guy, but I, I think of others. Sometimes too often, but, you know, I put people sleep, and I don't need to be rumbling down at 5.30 in the morning, you know? I can hold the clutch. What's the big deal? Hold the clutch. Look at that. It cuts down cuts down all the noise. You can't even hear a motorcycle now. I release the clutch. You <laughs> people shaking in their beds right now. Why don't we pull over here to my gas station? I got enough gas, the full tank. Yeah, you know what? This will give me a chance to uh, do like a first check. I mean, I did some good hard turning there. Yeah, we're good, man. We're good. We're good. All these guys. George Rambling Man, Living Country USA. Buckeye Drew. I voted today. Spurn a Cowboy. We're going to be seeing him down there, I think. I think he's making it. Got Twisty in there. National Rifle Association support. I ride ties. My boy, man, I love that guy. He's awesome. And of course, you know, freaking Harley. All right, I have a jacket here. I think that's a jacket. No, that's not a jacket. Actually, I think. Yep, jacket's right here. <laughs> right underneath all these bungee cords. Oh, man. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just going to put my rain gear on, that might help. Alright, I'm going to turn the um, GoPro off. I only have two batteries for this trip, which sucks. I wanted to get a couple more, but I just, I don't know, man. Between work and everything else, getting ready, I didn't have a chance. So, we'll check in with you guys, alright? I'm going to put my jacket on. Peace.